Hi guys, this is Tanya here with the Memory Lane Keepsakes and I have entry number 13 for my Think Outside the Box challenge that's going on. This is from Sue over at the Messy Mom's Life, guys. This is her entry and I cannot wait to see what she has designed for my entry. So let's go ahead and get into it. So first off, we have this beautiful card here and she has my name and it looks like we have some little... um embellishments in the center right there I love the way that looks and it says oh hello and I don't think she'll mind that I share this with you guys but she pretty much says Tanya congrats on your growing channel here is my entry to your challenge I wanted to make you um, I wanted to make for you an entire pocket letter made from stamped images. I have never done that before, so I hope you like it. Hug Sue, the messy mom's life. Thank you so much, Sue, and I'm so honored that you entered into my challenge. And I love your card. Love it. All right. I love this tissue paper, polka dots. It reminds me of one of my daughter's um, dresses from Easter one year ago, and it had all these beautiful polka dots in it. So we're going to go ahead and get started. All right, so this is your beautiful IC card, and it says, The beauty of nature never grows old. And I love this background paper. It is absolutely gorgeous. I love the flowers, and I love the butterflies, the hearts, the arrows. And it says, Bloom, rain, and showers. And it's got, like, different um, little writing and words in the background. I love that. This is absolutely gorgeous. So simple, but at the same time, so unique. And I love the girl on the bench right here. And the flowers and the birds. Just nature. I love that. Gorgeous. So let's learn some things about Sue. So Sue's channel, her YouTube channel is called The Messy Mom's Life. And um, her date of birth is October 20th. And her favorite color is pink, green, and gray. And her favorite medium is glitter and shakers. So great to know. And let's check a look at her IC card again, guys. This is absolutely gorgeous, So You did a fabulous job. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this beautiful pocket letter that she was talking about, guys. All right, so this first part right here, I have to say I absolutely love this butterfly washi. It's absolutely gorgeous. And she has hello right here. And then she used that same beautiful stamp tree again. I love that. You have to tell me where you got that, So It's absolutely beautiful. And then we have the little girl with the bench on there again. And then she also added um, some washi at the top right there. And then she's also placed, um, she got me some, there's some dandelion um, stamp right here. I like that. And then it's a shaker in the center. Yay. I love that. So cool. And she even put a flower in the center. I like that. That's really unique. And then um, we have a bird cage with a butterfly, which I love bird cages. And then right here we have music notes, which I absolutely love music. And another beautiful bird cage with a butterfly. And I love this background paper here. It's absolutely gorgeous. And we have a bicycle here. And I love bikes as well. So everything that you have in this pocket letter is absolutely gorgeous. And the stamp images is something unique and different, but simple and chic. I really like how you did this. I really, I mean, you did a great job. So definitely keep on definitely doing pocket letters with the stamp images. Because I say it, it does work for you. Um, not just that. It just adds a different little um, style to creating and crafting. So you own this something. I'm definitely going to have to like take that idea and borrow it for a little bit. But I love it. So thank you so much for making this beautiful pocket letter. And on the back here, you have some um, flat back pearls that you've gifted me. Which I'm definitely going to use. I use a lot of these in my projects. And then you also gave me some more. These right here are green. So I'm definitely going to be using those. And then you also gifted me some bowls. So thank you for that. And then right here, you gave me some sticky notes. And then there's the shaker again. And then also you gave me some, um, some tags that you made right here. Some clips that I can use. Thank you. And I love this paper. That is absolutely beautiful. It looks like, it looks like bubbles, like different colored bubbles is what it reminds me of. And right here, you gave me some more pearls, which I'm definitely going to be using that for a project that I have coming up. 
and you gave me some paper clips that are hearts these are really pretty it's my favorite color i love it purple heart paper clips cool and then you gave me some tags love these tags so thank you so much so now let's go ahead and get into your points so i have you down for your ic which is really beautiful and i have you down for your pocket letter which you did a fabulous job on that and i got your card right here all right so with everything i am going to slide your pocket letter out the way there and i have you right here all right so i have you down for entry number 13 so and you did a vr i did see it you have two points for that and you did an ic which was three points and then you also did a pocket letter a big one which is five points so i have you down for a total of 10 points for my challenge and i'm gonna go ahead and highlight that and seal it and i want to thank you so much for entering my challenge guys i always try to support sue over at her channel she is so awesome i really think the world of her i love being a part of what she has going on so i'm definitely gonna place a link at the bottom of this video so you guys can go over and show her some crafty love as well sue thank you so much for taking out time to enter into my challenge you guys be blessed and have a wonderful crafty day. This is Tanya with Memory Lane Keepsakes, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.